In this episode, I'm giving you some information that might help us pinpoint a release window for the next skate game. This is a quick one, so sit back, relax, and let's talk some skate. Welcome back to another episode of the Hippie Jump Podcast, a podcast all about the video game franchise Skate. I am your host, William, and if you enjoy what I bring you today, don't forget to like, subscribe, and rate the podcast. I would really, really appreciate it. In today's episode, I'm doing something a little different than what I usually do. Instead of writing out a whole episode and, and editing it all together and doing all of that, I'm kind of just sitting down really quick and talking straight to you guys about some information that I learned today. Now, none of this information in this video will confirm a Skate 4 release date. Obviously, I don't have information to that, but some information about some upcoming EA games kind of can point us in the right direction of what we're looking at in terms of when we might get Skate 4. So enough about that, let's just jump right into what I'm talking about. This is going to be a shorter video than usual, I'm just going to be bringing you guys news straight up and then that's it, no comments or anything. I literally just put out a video yesterday, so I'm not going to reflect on the comments and everything yet. I'm going to let that breathe a little bit more, but right now I'm just bringing you the news, that's it. So enough of that, let's jump right into it. So I'm going to an article from IGN by Rebecca Valentine. We're going to go through the information that she provided us in this article. So let's jump in. So the article is titled EA teases four games in 2023, including a new remake and major IP. So let's jump into this article. Electronic Arts offered its investors a sneak peek at what it's got cooking for 2023 today during its earnings report, including a planned major IP as well as an unannounced remake. So obviously, right now we can say Skate 4 is not a remake of a game. So we can rule that out. You know, we got four games. One of them is a remake. It's not Skate 4. I mean, you can call Skate 4 a reboot if you want, but it's definitely not a remake. Now, major IP, it's a major IP. So we'll see if that makes sense. The article goes on to say, a slide on EA's Q4 2022 earnings presentation gives a look at its next four months of releases. With F1 22 in Q1, FIFA and Madden NFL in Q2, and Need for Speed and NHL in Q3. So those are the remaining months of the year for EA, right there, those games that I just named. And then we get into Q4, which starts in January. So let's jump into it. In Q4, which covers January through March of 2023, we get one named franchise, PGA Tour. Okay, got PGA Tour. But we also see four big enticing unknowns, it says. One, major IP. Two, partner title. Three, remake. Four, sports type. So if you look at these, it's not gonna be a partner title because that's something like a Star Wars game, probably Jedi Fallen Order, I would imagine, or Jedi Fallen Order 2, whatever it'll be called. The article goes on to say, it's not clear now exactly what any of these four are. The remake invokes thoughts of the known Dead Space remake, but it's unlikely this is the case. EA both mentions in a footnote that all four games have not yet been publicly disclosed and Dead Space was officially announced last year. So it looks like we're getting a second remake of something in 2023. So right there, what they said in the article have not yet been publicly disclosed. That is important. So Skate 4 has been publicly disclosed. We, uh, we know about that game. EA has came out about that game and it is announced. It's a game. So you might be thinking, well, what are we looking at this article for? if there's no possibility that these games are Skate 4. Well, I'll get to that in a second. Let's keep going. For the major IP, it's possible we're looking at the next Dragon Age or Mass Effect game, both of which are currently in development but haven't been given full-blown public announcements with titles and fanfare. So the article keeps going. So the article continues. As for the other two, one possible guess for the sports title is that we're finally seeing the fruit of EA's announced return to EA Sports College Football. Since no title has officially been revealed yet, we just know they're working on it. So we got a remake that we don't know yet, 
a major IP that might be Dragon Age, might be Mass Effect, could be something else. It's very possible. We're not too sure on that one. And then partner title, I'm pretty sure it's a Star Wars game. It's It's got to be the next Jedi Fallen Order. And then sports title, which is the college football game that EA is currently working on. Now, what does any of this have to do with Skate? <laughs> I know you're asking that, you're like, why am I watching this? Well, I think this is kind of important information in terms of Skate. We can now be fairly certain that it's not coming out before March of 2023. So until Q4 2023, it looks like we will not be getting Skate 4. I've been saying over and over that this game might come out in fall of 2023. I do not think it is possible that it will release before then. But this information right here just gives me more fuel to that theory. So I know this isn't confirmation on Escape 4 release date or anything like that, but it is giving us an idea of when we can expect it. And we can almost for sure cut out from here to March of next year. After that, I mean, it's fair game, who knows? It's wide open, but personally, I don't think it will be until next fall. Maybe even winter around holiday season. Who knows? But what do you guys think of this? I just want to bring this quick information to you because I know I've seen people saying, oh, it's going to come out later this year, which is very optimistic, <laughs> or in the beginning of next year, in the spring. And I just want to put this information out there to maybe give you an idea. And maybe you can kind of come up with a theory of your own of when you think this game is going to come out based on this information. So thank you for watching. I really appreciate all the comments and the love and everything. Don't forget to subscribe and like the podcast if you enjoyed it. Thank you for tuning in for this really quick hit episode. One more thing, it is Skate 3's birthday, the day I am recording this. So happy birthday, Skate 3. You're an incredible video game. So thank you guys and go play some Skate. Oh,